Hi, my name is Allison Crony. I am the program director at the Elliott School of Fine and Applied Arts in Boston, Massachusetts. I want to thank all of you who were able to attend the last two salon series conversations titled Whose Standards? Racial Equity in the Field of Craft and Design. If you weren't able to attend, the two conversations will be released mid-November on the Critical Craft Forums podcast uh, available on iTunes. I started this week and although I'm tired, I'm also inspired and motivated because we were able to have these authentic, unbridled conversations with folks who are doing the work needed to address racial justice in our society and in the institutions of craft and design. I hope that you started this week motivated and inspired as well. I recognize that many of you are looking for concrete next steps to do in your life. And although I cannot provide a path forward, what I can provide is three things. One, a reminder that this work starts with us, that if we do this work individually in our own lives, then a path forward, the next steps will become clear so that we can impact our larger community, our family, our neighborhood, our organizations that we work with, and even our society as a whole. Secondly, I can remind ourselves that the Elliott School is in a moment of flux, we all are. And we're taking this moment to pause, pause half of our programs, we're critically looking at our past, we're re-envisioning and evaluating our current programming and building, and then we're optimistically looking at our future to craft the future we want for ourselves. We want to invite you in that process through participation in the Salon Series Conversations. The next one will happen on December 3rd at 7 p.m. We're inviting our 2020 artisan residents, Carolyn Shadid Lewis, along with the Team Bridge assistants, to showcase the Intergeneration Project, which is a, a document, documentary in progress. And it really processes the current moment in time through storytelling, letter writing, and animation. Through the perspectives of indigenous, uh, immigrant, black, educators, activists, uh, community health workers, um, artists. And so I hope that you come and attend that. Third and last, I want to invite you to support a fundraising, cam fundraising campaign that we are almost completing. The Elliott School is providing um, a thousand, over 1,300 art kits to Boston Public School kids. We recognize that without art, early in their lives, young people will not be fully equipped to be successful in this world. Art provides an opportunity for them to express themselves, to develop creative thinking skills, um, develop pride in themselves, problem solve. Um, so without art, they will not be prepared to do that. And we're asking you to support that effort. So I wanna thank you in advance for clicking on the link and donating to that effort as we approach the end of the KIP fundraising campaign. And I also wanna thank you for coming on this journey with us. I can't wait to see where this journey leads us. Thank you.